In this lesson, we'll explore the Theme Builder in Divi 5. The Theme Builder is one of Divi's most powerful features because it gives you complete control over the design of your website structure. Unlike the Theme Options or the Customizer, the Theme Builder allows you to design headers, footers, and templates for posts and pages directly inside Divi. To access the Theme Builder, go to your WordPress dashboard, open Divi, and select Theme Builder. Here you'll see the interface, which includes the global template at the top and space to create new custom templates below. Let's start with global templates. These include the site-wide header, body, and footer. For example, if you create a global header, every page on your website will automatically use it. When you update that header, the changes appear everywhere instantly. The same is true for the global footer. This approach saves time and keeps your design consistent across the entire site. You can also create custom templates for specific content. For example, you might want all blog posts to share the same design. To do this, you create a new template and assign it to posts. The same process works for individual pages, categories, or even custom post types. This flexibility means you can design for different types of content while managing everything in one place. Each template opens in the Divi Builder, just like a page. This gives you full design control and access to all the modules you already know. The workflow is simple. Create a template, assign it to the content you want, and then design it visually. Some common uses for the Theme Builder include creating a global header and footer, designing a unique blog post layout, or building custom templates for category pages. Instead of relying on default WordPress layouts, you can design everything in Divi for greater flexibility and consistency. Let me give you a live example from my own website. In my Theme Builder, you'll see that I've created different templates for posts, categories, and WooCommerce products. The green color on the global header and footer indicates they are global templates. Some of my other templates are black, which means they are not global and have unique designs. Here's my global footer. It's built entirely with Divi modules, which gives me much more flexibility than the old WordPress footer widgets ever could. Now let's look at my post template. The placeholder text that says your dynamic post title will display here is the post title module. This automatically pulls the title from my posts. Below that, I've added the featured image module and the post content module, which dynamically pull in the featured image and the main content from each post. Now let's see how this works in practice. I'll switch over to one of my actual posts. You can see that the title is being pulled in dynamically along with the featured image and the post content, exactly as we set it up in the template. Later in our project walkthrough module, us will build a complete theme template from the ground up so you can see the entire process in action. That covers the theme builder in Divi 5. With this tool, you can design your site's global structure and create templates for any type of content. In the next lesson, we'll explore the role editor and see how you can manage permissions for different users.